Welcome to the tutorial of solar electric panel system design. In this topic, we will learn that how to design the solar electric panel. Solar electric panel also known as solar PV models that is solar photovoltaic panel. Solar electric panel are generally using to save the power and in case of power failure means in case of power emergency. So that to design the solar electric panel or PV panel system, we need to calculate the actual or emergency power demand required for the building. So that to calculate the power demand, we need to operate the excel sheet. To calculate the actual power or the actual power demand, we need to calculate into the excel sheet like this. There is the serial number, the area of application or the appliances. power in watts the power required for that appliances into watts and the quantity and the last one is the power in kilowatt so this is how to prepare the excel sheet to calculate the electrical power demand for the serial number 1 we need to calculate the power required for the typical flat for the building Suppose in case there is a one building and into that building there is the multiple typical flat is available. So we need to calculate each and every flat power demand. So for example, I will calculate typical flat power demand required. So I will mention over here into that the serial number one is the LED or CFL bulb. For the LED or CFL bulb, the actual power required is the 40 watts. Suppose in one typical flat, there is the 8 numbers of CFL bulb. So the total power is power in watts multiply by quantity divided by 1000 means 1 kilowatt is equal to 1000 watts. That's why I need to multiply it, divide it by 1000. So it is the answer come in a 0.32 kilowatts. Same the appliance number 2 is the fans. If in a typical flat there is the 3 number fan we need to run. The power required for a typical fan is the 80 watts. So the total is 0.24 kilowatt. Same if we need to run the TV into our typical flat the power required for the TV is around 120 watts and the quantity is around 1 so the total power required for the tv is 0.12 kilowatt any supply for example 6 by 16 ampere connection we required the power generated by the 6 by 16 ampere is around 3000 watts quantity one number so it will around 3 kilowatt so the total power for one flat is around 3.68 this is the total total power required in flat in case of emergency now we need to calculate the common area like lift passage corridors etc for that i will calculate first For the common area, I will calculate the passage lighting requires one bulb required 40 watts and around if in the passage the entire building has the 100 bulbs. So the power required for that 100 bulbs is approximately 4 kilowatt. Then I need to calculate the street light. or the compound light for example each street light bulb gives the 100 watts the total quantity is around 20 numbers so it will be automatically come 
2 kilowatts required for the street light staircase lighting Suppose the staircase lighting each bulb has the 60 watts and the number of staircase lighting is around 20 so the total power required for that staircase lighting is around 1.2 kilowatt and the emergency service like lift lift also required the emergency services emergency power so it is around each lift takes the 400 watts so around if there is a two lifts the total power required for the lift is around 0.8 kilowatt water pumps next is the water pumps takes around 3000 watts for each water pumps if there is a two water pumps for the building it will take 6 kilowatts so i need to calculate the total power demand for building is around we need to calculate the total power required for the building is around typical flat plus the common services that is 17.68 so with the buffer for the average we need 18 kilowatt power for the entire building so this can i calculate the entire power demand required for the building so i need to generate the 18 kilowatt from the solar electric panel